A preacher helped lead Beaumont police to suspects accused of dozens of metal thefts. KFDM's Lauren Hewitt explains what the pastor saw and how the crime is affecting his church. So they just pulled it off here and pulled it from over at that end over there. Preacher Richard Walker watches his workers repair three of his church's AC units. It, it's, it's wrong and it's, it hit a lot of churches, not just this one. It, you know, a lot of other churches they've hit. It's part of a recent ration copper thefts. Ridgewood Church of Christ has been hit twice, three weeks ago and Thursday morning. About five o'clock in the morning, I was in this room right here working on my Sunday lesson when all of a sudden I heard a huge noise. It sounded like a huge windstorm. When he ran outside, he didn't see anyone. Fortunately, uh, I came out, I guess when I hit that door, uh, they ran off because they would have gotten this one, this one, and everything else. He called 911 after police left. Walker spotted one of the suspects running through the vacant Ridgewood Retirement Center. A man running away from me carrying some copper, and so he probably was watching to see when the police would leave so that he would be able to get away. He called police with a description. Officers later arrested 20-year-old Trayvon Cunningham and 19-year-old Justin Book. Because of their cooperation with the police detectives, and their confessions, we've been able to basically, looks like we're going to be able to solve close to 70 or more cases. We had to redo the last one. Metal thieves caused more than $10,000 in damage to the church, money the church would have used to help others. The sin of these people is not only impacting their lives, it's impacting a lot of other people who also now are struggling and aren't going to be able to be as helped as much as we have in times past. The preacher is trying to make sure it doesn't happen again. We're going to be uh, fencing this in and doing other things uh, to protect ourselves in the future. Protection from the growing number of thieves targeting metal. A church that was the end of the line for two men police say victimized businesses across the city. All this pain and damage that they have caused, you know, we don't have to worry about them doing it again. In Beaumont, Lauren Hewitt, KFDM 6 News. The two suspects are in jail on two counts each of metal theft. Police expect to pursue more charges.